But there has been, let me give you a little bit of good news, um, because a lot of Americans are anxiously awaiting the return to some semblance of normalcy, to some place we can go where the country starts to open again while being ever mindful of this doggone virus that is not going away. Uh, numbers are going down dramatically in the Northeast. There is an uptick in states like North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, Florida, Arizona, Texas. Um, of course, with the news about the GOP convention essentially being moved to Jacksonville, Florida, where we attend to, to go for the broadcast because we cover every Republican convention, over the years, Jacksonville is a hot spot. Florida see, is seeing um, an increase in infections. And of course, there's a gigantic debate over whether or not the increase in infections is resulting from the increase in testing. Is there actually more infection? What do you make of the rallies where people are shoulder to shoulder, thousands and thousands of people? So all of that is sort of in the mix. but. They had a prediction that d the economists from Dow Jones uh, expected that there would be an 8 .8 percentage point increase in retail sales for the month of May. Well, retail sales shattered those already lofty expectations. This was just released. Retail, so retail sales alone powered 16.8% higher from the month previously. Again, more than double the estimate of 8% from the Dow Jones economists, reversing the plunge of 16.4% from a month ago. Clothing and accessory stores reported the biggest percentage gain, 188%. Sporting goods, hobby, musical instruments, bookstores rose 88.2%. Now, all of this added to an already upbeat mood from Wall Street. And it is, I suspect, the worst nightmare of those who think that Donald Trump will be defeated by Joe Biden on November the 3rd. Uh, uh, if the economy comes roaring back in the next few months, in the next six months, this is Donald Trump's election to win. And everybody seems to know it. The polls are dreadful right now. He's underwater everywhere. We're in a bad place. We've got tension and unrest in the country. We have um, a, 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 a virus that has not yet dissipated. We have great economic uncertainty. We have millions of Americans who are still out of work. We've got a lot of work to do.